have to eat the dream. You have to sleep the dream. You have to dream the dream. Hello, Strand Team family. Look, I'm right back with another great video. If you're new to the Strand Team family, welcome to the Strand Team family. All we do over here is get gains. If you have any video suggestions or any video requests, all you got to do is put them at the bottom, and I promise you I'm going to make that video happen. A lot of Strand Team family has been like, hey, man, we want a crazy arm workout, but we want it to be super set. Now, listen, there's so many different ways you could train your arms. Everybody asks me, should you train your biceps first or should you train your triceps? In all honesty, I think you should train your triceps. That's just me personally, since they are bigger. And if you get a nice pump in your biceps, it is a little bit harder to fully contract your triceps. That's just me personally, but you can do them either way. I've done them and had great workouts starting with my biceps. And also I had great workouts when I just start with my triceps. But this one right here, it's going to be supersetted. If you don't know what a superset means, that means you're going to pair two exercises and do one right after the other. We're going to do a tricep exercise and then we're going to follow it with a bicep exercise. We'll rest about 45 seconds and we will repeat this. This right here is about to have y'all's arms on swole. That is way too much talking. So let's jump straight into this killer arm workout. We're going to superset the flat bench easy curl bar extensions with the advanced dumbbell curls. Now listen, the way I want you to perform your extensions, I want you to bring that bar all the way over your head. Now I want you to press it up and squeeze. We have three sets and we're gonna stay between eight to 10 reps and I want you to increase the weight every single set. The first set, I had a 25 pound plate on each side. Then the second set, we went to a 35 pound plate on each side. And then the third and final set, we put a 45 pound plate and it felt like death. I ain't even gonna lie to you. And immediately after you finish your extensions, now you're gonna stand up and do the dumbbell advanced curls. All you're gonna do is you're gonna hold your left arm and hold it in flex. Now it's gonna be halfway up, so it's gonna be under tension. Now with your right arm, you're gonna do seven reps. I want you to contract at the top and feel that stretch as you're going down. Now after you get seven reps, now you're gonna hold this one halfway up and keep that tension on your bicep. And with your left arm, now you're gonna perform seven reps. This right here is one of my favorite bicep exercises by far. The pump is just unreal. And after you get seven reps, now you're gonna do seven reps with them together. This right here is humbling. Now let's say you get stuck at like four reps. That's perfectly fine. Do not get discouraged. Maybe rest for like five to six seconds. Now pick the weight right back up and finish your set. Now after finish with that, our next superset is going to be the dumbbell overhead extensions. And we're going to superset that with the dumbbell sideways hammer curls. Now with the dumbbell overhead extensions, I want you to go as heavy as you possibly can, guys. We have this for three sets. And every single set, I want you to increase the weight. Your third set should be a heavy set and you should struggle to get eight reps. As you're seeing the video, I want you to bring that dumbbell all the way back as deep as you possibly can. Now press it up and squeeze your triceps. Now come right back down and squeeze your triceps. Go as heavy as you can on the third set. I think I did like 105 to even 110 pounds. Like I say, this exercise will let you just go extremely heavy and it's just a great overall mass building exercise. Immediately after you finish this, you're gonna stand up. Now you have the dumbbell sideways hammer curls. This is another great exercise for mass. In my personal opinion, it's probably in my top five. Like you're seeing in the video, you're gonna grab a heavy dumbbell. You're gonna bring it up right across your chest and squeeze. Now come down and control it, bring it right back up and squeeze. You have this again for three sets, eight to 10 reps. If all possible, every single set increase the weight. If you cannot increase the weight, that's fine, but make sure the weight is challenging. If you're getting your eight to 10 reps on any of these exercises or whatever the rep range that I'm telling you, if you're getting them super easy, listen, you're cheating yourself. Do not cheat yourself and just go through the range of motion and just go through the movements. We want to be maximum effort every single exercise, every single set so we can get the most gains possible. Now to finish with that, we have the cable rope push downs and we're going to superset that with the easy curl bar reverse preacher curls. Game certified guys. Now listen, when you do these rope push downs, I want you to choke up. Most people, they go all the way down to the handles. Me personally, I feel like I can squeeze my triceps so much more when I choke up on the rope. You can see in the video what I'm talking about in my hand positioning where I'm all the way at the top. Now stand up tall, tuck your elbows in, push it down and pull the rope apart and squeeze. Come up and control it, push it right back down and squeeze. This right here is going to tie in your triceps something phenomenal by this point the third exercise in this workout you are going to have a crazy pump your arms are going to be on swole again we have three sets and we're going to stay between eight to twelve reps your third set is going to be your heaviest and you should struggle to get eight reps but it is also a drop set so like as soon as you get your eight reps go ahead and lighten the weight up i think i went from 180 pounds all the way up to like 120 now aim to like 12 to 13 to even 15 reps don't even put a number in your head go into your triceps say they are done remember 
remember, this is superset. So after your rope push downs, you're going to go right over there to these preacher curls. Now listen, we're not going to do it on the normal preacher side. You're going to do it on the side that's flat. This right here allows no cheating. You can't involve your shoulders. You can't involve your back. It is all biceps. You are going to love this. We have this exercise three sets for 15 to 20 reps. I let my arms hang all the way down. Now I think about bringing my wrist all the way up to my face and I squeeze. I come all the way back down and count at least two to three seconds. Then I bring it right back up and squeeze. Like you're seeing in the video, I'm squeezing at least one to even two seconds at the top. Now, once you get into your deeper reps, maybe like 12 to 13, I'm not even going to lie to you. It's going to start burning. It's going to start burning to a point where you're going to feel like, I don't know if this is good. <laughs> so once you get to there, that's fine if you just start repping it out, but still aim for at least 15 to even 20 reps on every single set. Now, by this time, guys, your arms are going to be already maximum pump. So it's going to go ahead and finish them off with this last super set just to tie everything in. We have the single arm cable rope kickbacks, and we're going to superset that with the single arm overhead cable curls gain certified. We're only going to do two sets for both of these exercises, but we're going to do 15 to 20 reps on both of them. Like you're seeing, when I'm doing these single arm rope kickbacks, I'm trying to kick back up and over my body. A lot of people, they just kick straight back. Now listen, I'm not taking nothing away from that, but try that and then try it the way that I'm doing it. Kick back and kick up. Watch how much more you can contract your triceps with you fighting that gravity that much more. Now, like I say, I'm not hating. You're still going to contract it if you kick straight back, but like you said in the video, you can see how I'm getting veiny in my triceps when I'm kicking it up. This right here, guys, is just maximum effort and maximum contraction on every single rep. Like I say, we're going to aim for 15 to 20 reps. And like I say, this is all supersets. So after you do your kickbacks, now you have the overhead curl. Now, I want you to go somewhat heavy with this. I ain't even going to lie to you. So you got 15 to 20 reps and you're going to do two sets. So I think once I got to like maybe 10 and 11, I started using a little bit of momentum. Like you're seeing in the video, I'm taking my opposite arm and I'm kind of pulling my body just a little bit just to get that weight started. And then I quit and let my bicep bring it up and curl and contract gain certified. And I'll tell you a secret with this. If you notice that your elbow is starting to drop, either lighten the weight up or just stop and rest for maybe like 10 seconds. I want your elbow to either be straight or I want it to even be pointing up a little bit. That way you're gonna keep that tension on your bicep. Because what's gonna happen is you're gonna get tired and the elbow's gonna start dropping and you're gonna start incorporating more and more of your shoulders. But listen, we're not here to work shoulders. That's another day. Right now we're focusing on these guns. So like I say, you have two sets for 15 to 20 reps. And if you're serious about your gains like me, both sets you should aim for at least 20 reps and that is it. This workout right here, guys, is gains certified your biceps and your triceps are going to be pumped this workout should not take you no hour you should be able to do this workout if you train by yourself within 45 minutes that's the thing that i've learned with arms you do not have to go in there and spend three to four to five hours or do like a thousand exercises. you go in there and do certain exercise focus on stretching and contracting the muscle and i promise you you are going to see and make some serious gains but like i tell you in every single video strength team make sure you like this video Make sure you share this video, but at the end of the day, make sure you keep getting them gays. You have to eat the dream. You have to sleep the dream. You have to.